In news from Nepal, eight-year-old Ojaswi Ghulu was appointed living goddess Kumari of Panauti, an ancient town in Nepal in 2014. She lives a normal life like other kids except when there are major festivals during which she is worshipped. After the living goddess enters her adolescence and begins her first menstruation, the search of new Kumari starts. Ojaswi's mother, however, plans to opt to retire her at the age of nine. Ojaswi Gulu was only eight months old when she was anointed the living goddess Kumari of Panauti, an ancient town in Nepal, after a gap of eight decades. It was a moment of pride for the ancient city as it revived the almost extinct cultural practice in 2014. The eight-year-old Kumari lives a normal life like any other kids except when there are major festivals during which she is worshipped. During the festivity, she has to get up early in the morning, freshen up and put on the regalia and get herself decorated. The goddess appears in regalia only twice a year and is worshipped on the Shain and Ram Navni festival. She also attends school. However, in order to maintain the sanctity, the living goddess only takes part in functions that are held inside the home or the family. The principal of her school, Bishnu Prasad Dahal, said, The school authorities were very sensitive about the goddess and the area around her is kept clean and she is given a separate place to eat. The anointment of Kumari in Panauti doesn't follow the procedure of Kathmandu for similar ritual. In Nepal, after the living goddess enters her adolescence and begins her first menstruation, the search for new Kumari starts. Ojaswi's mother, however, plans to opt to retire her at the age of nine. <laughs> As per her, Panoti possibly would get a new living goddess next to she. In Nepal's traditions, a living goddess is seen as a form of Hindu goddess, being the symbol of religious tolerance, while a number of people here in the Himalayan nation come from the Buddhist background. For centuries, the goddesses were used by kings to legitimize their rules.